how your heart works. To understand cardiac catheterization, it helps to know more about how your heart works. The heart is a muscle that pumps blood to all parts of your body. Like other muscles, the heart needs a steady supply of blood in order to work right. Blood carries oxygen to the heart and the rest of the body through blood vessels called arteries. The coronary arteries wrap around the surface of the heart, supplying the heart muscle with the oxygen-rich blood that it needs. The left anterior descending artery supplies blood to the front and left side of the heart. The circumflex artery supplies blood to the back and left side of the heart. The right coronary artery supplies blood to the right side and bottom of the heart. A healthy coronary artery has no blockages. It has smooth, flexible walls that can expand to let more blood flow through when needed. The heart is divided into two sides. Each side has two chambers and two valves. The right side of the heart receives blood from the body and pumps it through the lungs, where the blood receives oxygen. The left side of the heart receives the oxygen-rich blood from the lungs and pumps it throughout the body. The right atrium, right ventricle, left atrium, and left ventricle are chambers that hold blood as it flows through the heart. The atria and ventricles are separated by valves. These act like one-way doors between the upper and lower chambers. Their role is to keep blood moving forward. When your heart beats, valves open to let blood through. After each beat, valves close to keep blood from flowing backward. A normal valve opens with each heartbeat to let blood into the next chamber. When the beat ends, the valve shuts, keeping the blood from flowing backward.